Before we start, I'd just like to introduce Mayor Noam Bramson and invite him to say a few words. Thank you very much, Captain, and ladies and gentlemen, good morning. It's a pleasure on behalf of our entire city to welcome you to New Rochelle City Hall, and an even greater pleasure for me to congratulate uh, these seven exceptional colleagues uh, and uh, acknowledge the extraordinary work that they have done, the professionalism, uh, the dedication that has enabled them to uh, reach this new station. And I know that our community has already been strengthened by what they have done and will be strengthened further uh, by the additional leadership that they will now have an opportunity to demonstrate within our police department. So, lady and gentlemen, <laughs> uh, well done and, and congratulations on all that has brought you to this point. It's an honor to work in your company. And let me just say uh, one additional word, and I, I, I don't usually comment on such things, uh, but I, I, I feel perhaps it's, it's appropriate to do so. Um, there has been, we all know, uh, a great discussion all around our country and to some degree in our community uh, about justice and fairness when it comes to policing and when it comes to things much broader than policing. And when I listen to this debate, I often feel as though people are being forced into one of two corners, where you can either acknowledge that we still have challenges in our country, or you can stand with the police, but you can't do both. And I reject that as a completely false choice. It seems to me that anyone who's got open eyes can recognize that you do not erase centuries of injustice in a single generation. And we still have a long way to go, not just in the criminal justice process, but in every aspect of our society. And yet at the same time, we can be enormously grateful for and proud of what our police officers do every single day to put their safety on the line for our safety, to uphold the principle that you cannot have a strong community if it is not a safe community and to, in so many ways, make sure that cities in particular have benefited from a historic reduction in crime. So I want you to know that I am proud of our police force. I am proud of these individuals, not just for what I said earlier, but for, frankly, making it a habit of reaching out to our larger community, not just in the faces of a crisis, but as a matter of standard practice, because it's the smart and right thing to do. I'm proud that our police force has been pioneering efforts to make sure that the use of deadly force is a last resort and never a first resort. That is what we have done in New Rochelle, in many ways a model for what the nation is struggling to achieve today. So thank you for what you've done. It's an honor to be with each of you, and thank you to the families for lending your loved ones to the community of New Rochelle. It is a great gift that you have given us. Have a wonderful day.